On its surface, Callista looks like our moon, scarred and cratered by countless hits from asteroids. These impacts may have melted the surface ice for brief periods, allowing life to take hold. But in 1998, the Galileo spacecraft detected a much more promising incubator deep beneath Callisto's surface. Radioactive rocks and tremendous pressure in its core generate heat inside Callisto. The heat may be melting its icy crust from below, creating a hidden ocean. And hidden oceans could mean hidden life. As we fly closer to Jupiter, we find its largest moon, Ganymede. Ganymede is also deeply scarred. Ridges rise above its surface, like the tread on a tire. Those bright spots are craters, as big as five kilometers across, likely lined with frost. But these photos offer the most compelling clues to where life here might hide. They show flowing glaciers. Glaciers that resemble those on Earth. Ganymede's moving glaciers could also be signs of heat within. So, like Callisto, Ganymede could also have a hidden ocean buried beneath as much as 200 kilometers of ice.